What's up guys, welcome to Lens Sunday Boxing. So today we're gonna learn how to walk. So firstly, you wanna get into your boxing position. So I'm a righty, so I'm gonna make sure that my left foot's forward. I'm gonna bend my knees, chin down, and the hands are up. Now, in boxing, the direction you wanna to go to, that foot moves first, okay? So if I go forward, my front foot moves first. If I go backwards, my back foot moves first. If I go to the left, it's the left foot. And if I go to the right, it's the right foot that moves first. So it looks like this. So I go forward, front, then the back foot. I go backwards, back foot first, front foot second. I go to the right, right foot first, left foot second. I go to the left, left foot first, right foot second. Now one thing that you guys have to realize is that I always keep a wide stance between my legs. My legs are always wider than my shoulder width. That way I have a good center of gravity. I don't want to be, I don't want to have my legs too close to each other or else I'll be falling over, okay? Always think about the leaning tower of Pisa and think about the pyramids. The pyramids have a wide bottom and a small top. They've been standing for four to 5,000 years and the tower of Pisa has been up for a few hundred years. It has a small bottom and a small top, right? So it's tilted over. So you always want to be a pyramid. So wide stance. Another thing that you have to, to notice is that I never crisscross my legs, okay? If you crisscross your legs, you're gonna lose your balance. So you never wanna do this, okay? If I go forward, for example, I never wanna do this, okay? Now my stance is narrow. If I go to the left, for example, I never wanna do this, okay? So I'm crossing my legs. Whenever you cross your legs in a fight and you get hit, that's a perfect opportunity to fall down and then they count that as a knockdown. So what you want to do is always keep the legs far from each other, always wider than your shoulder width. I always like to align my front toes with my back heel. So see, they're aligned just like that, okay? I'm not on a straight line and I'm not too wide either. So when I'm wide like this, I become a big target, okay? So this is what we like to say standing square. So you never want to be standing square nor do you want to be standing on a straight line. I'm not on a skateboard, okay? So always keeping the front toes aligned with the back heel. So proper, so moving properly looks like this. Okay, so a beginner drill that you guys could do at home is literally move forward, backward, left, and right. So from here, forward, backwards, left, right. Another thing that has to be mentioned is that in real life we walk like this with the heels first. In boxing you walk with the ball of the foot first. So if you notice if I'm going forward it's the ball of the foot that lands first followed by the heel. Same thing when I go to, to any direction. So it looks like this. Okay, so now you guys know how to walk. Don't forget to like, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.